hospitalizations in Colorado take a little bit up again. Tonight, there are 173 people in hospitals across our state. That's eight more than yesterday. While this chart shows a slight increase over the past few days, the number of hospitalizations is still drastically lower than what we were seeing in mid-April. People, though, are lining up to get COVID-19 tests after the holiday weekend, but the city of Denver is now limiting testing at the state's busiest site. Sean Boyd joins us live at the Pepsi Center tonight. And Sean, the city was running out of tests last week. It, Karen, it now has an adequate supply of tests to meet the demand. The problem is the lab it's contracted with can't keep up with processing all those tests. Today, the city of Denver hit a new record for the number of tests administered in a single day here at the Pepsi Center, nearly 2,100. This site was closed over the holiday weekend, so some of it was pent up demand. So many people showed up, they closed the gates at 1230. About 500 people were still in line. They waited in their cars up to an hour and a half to get a test. Not only is demand for testing higher, the number of people testing positive is also up. Since the end of May, the city has tested nearly 40,000 people at the Pepsi Center. 3% of them are now testing positive compared to 2% a couple weeks ago, and the rate may be higher. It's taking twice as long to get results back because of the high demand. That's why the city is now limiting the number of tests it will administer each day. With this virus, we don't want people to get their results 10 days later. Um, and if you if you test that many people in a day, the lab only has so much capacity. And so um, we're going to keep it around 2000. Once we hit the 2000 mark every day, we're going to have to uh, unfortunately shut down the site. And I would actually say if you have health care and you are, have the ability to utilize your health care uh, to get a test, we ask you to do that. And starting tomorrow, the city will be updating its website with the number of tests it's done here every half hour so you don't drive down here and then get turned away because it's already hit that maximum of 2,000 a day. And if you think you have been exposed, health officials say you really should wait about four to five days because the virus doesn't show up right away. Live outside the Pepsi Center, Sean Boyd covering Colorado First. Sean, thank you. And